uh, you may talked uh, last round um, about you having to adjust to the fact that he doesn't mind fouls, uh, maybe like your your previous uh, place in San Antonio. Um, what did you make of that difference in philosophy? And were there any other things that you had to get your mind around in terms of how they do things with, with Boston as opposed to uh, in San Antonio? Yeah, um, I mean, um, in San Antonio, we, we try to, we have a lot of emphasis on, on not fouling or keeping them off the line. So, I mean, obviously they don't want dumb fouls here, but um, just trying to be a little more physical, um, just little things like that, that, I mean, it wasn't a big difference, but it's just a little bit, little adjustment that I had to make. And um, I mean, a lot of the, the system and everything was similar, uh, obviously with Coach Udoka's time in, in uh, San Antonio, but um, just, just getting used to the, the little nuances that, that go with each each team. First row on the left. I'm Mark Medina, NBA.com. I was wondering from a big picture standpoint, what jumped out to you with how Ime managed the group through the ups and downs of this season? Um, I mean, obviously I wasn't there at the beginning, um, but I think just being consistent, constantly pushing us, um, when, when things were really started rolling, I mean, he still would go back to um, little things that we need to work on. Um, I mean, just having that constant um, work ethic and stuff like that, that uh, has kind of wore off on the team. And um, it's been it's been a lot of fun. Steve? When, when it comes to um, knowing when to assert yourself offensively uh, versus not as the new guy, I mean, you can have coaches and players tell you things, or you can have game situations that kind of dictate it. I mean, where did you, how did you find your balance between, you know, I have to play the way I need to play versus, oh, I got to fit in and not rock the boat? Yeah, um, I mean, it, it was a, an adjustment. Um, just sometimes when you get to a new team, you're, you're like, uh, where do I fit in? Um, but everybody has been just telling me to be aggressive, be me. Um, so some games are, uh, I'll be a little, um, just trying to fit in and just out there. Um, people will pull me aside. It's like, no, nah, we need you to, to do what you do. So um, it's just good to have those those reminders. And um, I mean, I, I love playing for like the coaching staff and the, the teammates have just really been pushing me to just to do what I do. Mark. Yeah, obviously the Warriors have a lot of star power, most notably with Steph, Clay, and Draymond. But what do you think makes their supporting cast so unique? And how do you guys adjust to that, given their depth? Yeah, um, everybody understands um, where they're supposed to be. Um, I mean, it, it's a little random offensively, but it's controlled randomness. Um, I mean, Looney, Wiggins, um, Poole. Everybody, they come off the bench for them. Like they, they know where they're supposed to be. They know how to get those guys open, and um, I mean, they're always competing and, and doing what they need to do. So um, they got a good culture here, and they, they do a good job.